Senior midfielder and team captain Brooke Elby went from saving games it's off the line. to standing on the sidelines. I think the minute I got hit, I knew. It happened seven minutes in against NC State. So I stuck my leg out to keep her from just like shooting the ball out towards our um, defense. But the way my foot was extended, the way I planted, and the way she hit me just all combined for a fun little popping noise that kind of sticks in my mind still. That sound was her ACL tearing. It was a season ending injury, and I just think from there, my heart broke. She missed the red shirt cutoff by two games, but gained something from her lost season. Like, I guess I would never know the impact I made until I was injured. Head coach Anson Doran says Elby set the tone for this season. I attribute a lot of that to Brooke Elby, uh, to the standard that she set before she got hurt, uh, to the leadership she still demonstrates uh, with her teammates, uh, and I'm incredibly proud of her. On senior night, it was Elby who started the match. She surprised her team and finished her career on the field despite the injury. Fellow senior Sitara Murray has dedicated the season to LB. Uh, I want to win a national championship for my best friend. That's all I want to do. I personally think she deserves to go out as a winner this year. Regardless of the season's outcome, LB feels like she's already won. Obviously, it didn't go the way I planned, but it's probably been one of the most fun years that I've been here, and I wouldn't trade, I guess, my injury for anything.